Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Is a police department public property? When we say public property, what pops into your mind? Parks, libraries, streets, right? But what about police departments? They serve the public, sure, but does that make them public property? Let's dive in. First off, police departments are funded by taxpayer dollars. That's your hard-earned money at work. They provide safety and uphold the law, making them a crucial public service. But don't start thinking you can waltz in and put your feet up. Police stations have restricted areas for a reason. They store sensitive info and house detainees. Imagine if just anyone could stroll into the evidence room. Yet there are public areas too. Think lobbies and front desks, where you can report crimes or ask for assistance. These spaces are open to everyone, reinforcing the community feel. So, can you call a police department public property? Well, they are publicly funded and serve the community, but they also have limits to access for safety and privacy. It's a bit of both, you see. Remember, while you can visit, there are rules to follow. It's not a free-for-all like a picnic in the park. Respect and cooperation go a long way. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.